listen. Ain't nobody can- Yo, fuck you! No! Not it. no! No! The fuck is this? Can I read it? I love that story. Thank you. Oh god, what am I doing? Oh yeah, every day. Slap, taint, taint, slap. Just slap, 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 you know? Just all the time. Um, a lot of sponsors... Hey King, how you doing? Dude, whoa, fucking mother of... Son of a butt <laughs> shit. <laughs> oh, right. You guys get up. Yep, yep, yep. Got it. Got it. All right. Uh, hey, hi. Hi. I'm here. I'm live. I'm I'm actually on time. Um, hi. Welcome. Um, as always, if you are here for the security breach in the, the gameplay, skip ahead a couple of minutes. We're going to take some time, have a little chat first off. Um, this is the most I've been live on YouTube in a long time, actually. It's a little weird, uh, but I kind of want to go through the rest of security breach live just because like, I feel like. I was going through it and I was barely editing anything out in the first place during my recordings, but um, I feel like this part, like the 6 a.m. hour that I kind of broke the game with, because it's now 5.15 or whatever, I feel like the 6 a.m. hour is really the uh, the tried and true, like you have to be super cautious kind of hour, so... Um, Instead of spend hours upon hours trying to go through that and do it on a video and then try to chop it all up, I'll do it live. Um, I didn't know that there were retro CDs. I didn't know that there was a thing like the exotic butters thing. And uh, so I looked it up. I think, if I'm correct, I think there were 16 or were there 12? I don't remember. Hold on. Uh, did Dev FNAF. Security breach, retro CDs. Um, but there's sixteen. There's sixteen total CDs, and I could look up where all of them are. But I'm gonna try to give it a good what for first. I'm gonna try to maybe run around. I should move my face, and uh, I want to cause so all right uh. Shift tab, are you gonna work? No, of course not. Why would you ever work? Where's my Steam? Because we, we were also kind of on the side achievement hunting as well. So, let's see. Security breach. Uh, da -ba -da -ba. We are at 20 out of 29 achievements. So we're missing 9. And we did not get the collect all of the collectibles or all of the messages 
So there's definitely some more collectibles that I've missed out on. Mmm, butter. Yes, exotic butters. Butters that are so exotic that they're exotic. Okay. I should look up the, uh, like, what all the achievements are again. Because, alright, so we did BB World last time. We glitched that out, got that achievement, got that ready for whenever they finally release that. Uh, oh, hey, Freddy, you're looking super shiny there, bro brother. Uh, right, we're here. Where am I? What am I? Who am I? Why am I? Okay, I got six, so I need ten more retro CDs. I'm, I'm really, really thinking that these don't show up unless I'm in Freddy. And I gotta be real careful. Because, uh, Freddy's almost out of power. Low power. Nuts. That exact, that thing that I said of which he was having issues with it happened uh was there a power station a recharge station i'm gonna i i cleared most of these areas most most of the stuff here but that was before i knew that there were retro cds that i had to find so i th think it would probably be smart straight out to just start combing through some of these areas again and see if I can find any retro CDs that I may have missed. Because, like, there's stuff over here. You would think that maybe, like, over there would actually have something. I'm gonna start out at the entrance and we're gonna work our way in, like, checking everything. Just so I can see if I've missed something. I know that there's two collectibles that I can't seem to figure out how to get. And uh, those were in some interesting areas. Okay. Not seeing any retro CDs here. Freddy, can you go through there? Yes. Yes, you can. See, as far as I remember, it didn't have the retro CD show up. Unless I was, like, really close to them. I don't know. Should I just find the retro CDs? Like, should I just look up where they are? I don't have a lot of time to stream tonight, if I'm being honest. If we don't find any in this first area, then we might. We'll, we'll just look it up. You would think that there would be... one in here like on her seat or something like that but I guess not because one way or another one of the things that I really 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 want to make sure that I do is I want to make sure that I uh see or hear all of the stuff on those CDs tonight at the bare minimum. Okay. On um, one would help to... Like in probably places. Yeah, I mean, so, alright. Let's see here. Um... Ba -da -ba 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 -da -ba. I, I usually don't like looking it up, but I'm going to because I kind of really want to see all of this. Alright. We're just going to go to each one, one by one. We're going to go through them. It... I don't know. Was there any...
you have no idea how this game works. So, uh, have have you heard of Five Nights at Freddy's in the first place, Knight? All right. Uh, on the floor in the middle of the Fazbear Entertainment logo in the main atrium. Hi, Roxy. Okay, so do I need Freddy to see them? Yes, I do. Interesting. Roxy, I'm gonna need you to... Roxy. You can't hide forever. Ro Roxy, I'm gonna need you to... Make like a tree and move. My oh, that doesn't work. Ruined. Oh, that doesn't work. 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 That kid is just lucky. Is he? I feel like this is something a little bit more than luck. Okay, we're fine. I'm really scary to you. Haha, -ha, you just shoved your face into Freddy's crotch. That's weird. Okay, so we got that one on the wall above a red couch on the way to the hidden sister location room. Huh? Okay. No, Roxy, nobody loves you. Nobody ever loved you. You're... You failed. You 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 failed this city, and uh, Oliver Queen would be very upset with you. Uh, so, the original Five Nights at Freddy's games were definitely jump scare focused, but this one is the first, like you can go around and actually explore stuff. And uh, it's actually which way am I going? Where am I going? Who am I? Where am I? I don't remember the layout of this place. Uh, what do you guys think I have a compass in the... Oh, Rockstar Road. Perfect. Hmm, this seems... This seems like the wrong way. Well, we at least got a Freddy spot. But, uh, yeah, this one's the first one where you got the free roam, and, like... Five Nights at Freddy's is definitely jump scare oriented, for sure. But... Um... It's, uh, it's definitely not, like... Oh, nuts. It's definitely not bad as a game. Like, the... The developer... He was an indie dev. And, uh, he, he's living the developer dreams, essentially. He, he managed to make a game that people picked up on very quickly, and that game ended up exploding probably beyond anyone would have ever thought that it would. And, uh, wait, on a red couch. On the way to the hidden sister location room. Jesus, Freddy, it's already broken. Leave it alone, man. Good lord. But yeah, the the lore and like the the world behind this game is really what makes it at this point. Okay, looking for a red couch. Yeah, calm down, Freddy. Jesus, how many times do I gotta tell you? 
My man over here going crazy. Looking for a red couch. I mean, it, I have seven. And this is just number two. So if I don't find this one right away, then I'm just going to assume that I already have it. Which is probably a, a good thing to assume because I was going through this section pretty thoroughly. Freddy, relax, man. Good lord. Gonna yell? Yep, yep, there's him yelling. Okay, we're in here now. Okay, well... I, I'm gonna assume we have that. Okay, so let's see. Uh, on the wall above a red couch on the way to the hidden sister location room. I didn't see any red couches, so. Oh, wait. I'm fairly certain this is the red couch that they're talking about, and I'm fairly certain I got this one. Yeah, I think I got that one. Okay. In the Floxy plush's mouth under the hair and makeup sign at the Roxy salon. Well, you know, that's a good thing because that was one of the places that I never actually got to go back to last stream. And so that'll uh, prove to be beneficial. Yeah, I don't need to save. Let it freak out. I probably could have just kept going through and done the little trick to get out there, but, you know, whatever. Roxy, is that you? Why are you down here? Go to your salon, get a... Get some makeup or something. Get new eyeballs or something. Jeez. Man, Gregory, you got some serious stamina and leg muscles. Requires Freddy. Freddy, thank you. Hold on. I'm wondering if there's some in... Um, in Rockstar Row, the starting area retro Fazbear Museum with dark green walls centered in a cardboard cutout of the Kraken's jaw. I know I got that one. Uh, on a gray podium in the music room accessible through a door at the end of the Rockstar Row hallway. Okay. Uh, let's see. Any other Rockstar Row ones since we're here? I don't think so. Okay, so Hidden Sister Location Room, which I definitely got that one. I don't think I got the Roxy mouth on in the salon. Uh Rockstar Row, Kraken's Jaw, I definitely got it on a on a gray podium in the music room accessible through a door at the end of the Rockstar Row hallway. Music room? This? There's a great podium down here, then I... I think I got this one. Maybe? This is the... I think this is the music room hallway. Ready! Oh, hey, helpy. Uh, calm down. Freddy! Oh, Fred boy. Oh. Maybe this isn't a music room hallway. All right, Freddy, you go there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna see if I can maybe find a place. 
What's this? Ugh. Nope. That's terrifying. Fuck. Oh, wait. I thought there was one there, but maybe not. I remember looking at that, but maybe not. Gotta charge my flashlight. Is this the music room? Either way, I do remember getting one in this in one of these like side areas so i think i think it's safe to say we got that one if we didn't we'll come back to it freddy okay we got all those presents good Might as well jump into this. Charge up old Fred Bear. Loading. L loading still. There was definitely one there. That I had already gotten. I don't know what they call that. Alright, we'll, we'll just go through one at a time. Screw it. I, I'm trying to, like, go all around, and I don't think it's working out in my favor. Alright, so we got that. We got that. Roxy, can you, like, go somewhere? Like, literally in the middle of the atrium is very inconvenient for me. I don't care that I stole your eyes and ruined your entire animatronic body, but you're very inconvenient, if I'm being honest. I murdered you, stole everything that you were proud of and hopeful for, and you're just inconveniencing me now. Ooh, I didn't get something up there. I see you. Okay, so there should be a weird little Roxy plush. Um, Roxy plush mouth under the hair and makeup sign at Roxy's salon. Hair and makeup sign. Aha! It's weird that you have to like be up on it to with Freddy to see it. All right, so we got eight. We're halfway there. Then that one up there. I, I could have sworn I got that up there, but I guess not. Roxy Pinata. Well, now we can nyata the pin. Alright. Do a, a quick jog through the salon. See, like, the salon is another area. Like, the salon and bakery are both areas that were not utilized at all in the actual main story of the game. Which really, really continues to feed the, the thought process that I have that... I don't think this game is the original idea for the end product that they had. I I truly, truly believe that they had a different idea when they originally started making Security Breach. Because even the, even the title Security Breach does not make the most sense yes we're a small child yes we technically breached the security and broke into the place but that to me i don't feel like that is like the the full thing like i don't know i 
I just I feel like this game is half of what they were expecting to do in in the long run. All right, we gotta recharge Freddy, and then I'm pretty sure there's one in Roxy Raceway we're gonna grab. Oh, hey! Oh, Jesus. Easy there, buddy. Where's the... God, my sprint through here was just chaos incarnate. Okay. Uh, let's see. Monty Golf. Um, Bazer Blast in the bumper cars at Roxy Raceway. Oh, yeah. Above the cutout of Helpy, one of the side rooms in Rockstar Road. Okay, so I didn't get the podium one, maybe. Okay, so... The bumper cars? There's bumper cars? Where in the blue ball blazes are the bumper cars? Is that the bumper cars over there? Can I get through there with Freddy? No, of course not. Why would I ever be able to get through the thing that I want to get through to be able to do the thing that I want to do? Are you the bumper cars? You look bumper car-ish. You... Yeah, bumper cars! Come here, Freddy. No, Freddy, there's, there's, calm down, buddy. Getting a little, uh, getting a little antsy there, buddy. There it is. Got it. Okay. So, let's see. Um... On the Foxy plushie upstairs, first aid center past the Monty fence. I don't even know where the first aid center is. Uh, in a corridor next to the atrium by a small stage with a wallpaper behind it featuring Freddy and Bonnie. I did get that one. That one I definitely got. In the mouth of a Glamrock Freddy drink dispenser at Mazer size. Didn't go there. Cut out of Helpy in Rockstar Row. I definitely got it. Second karaoke room in the Faz Arcade. Didn't get that, I don't think. In the bumper cars at Roxy Raceway. I just got that one. Trophy case in Fazer Blast. Circular stand near the Golden Cupcake in the Bakery. Kids Cove. Bonnie's Bowling. Monty Golf. And then I guess... I guess I maybe didn't get the Grey Podium one. I don't know. We'll go back to that later if I don't find them all. Okay, so this is the last one in uh, this area, I th think. We're right next to something. Ooh. Let's save this real quick. I think we're next to, um... Which way? This way. I think we're next to Mazer Size, if I'm correct. Or not Mazer Size, Monty Golf. I think Monty Golf is right downstairs. No, Phaser Blast. Okay, um... Alright, let's see. Phaser Blast. By the trophy case in the Phaser Blast... Phaser Blaster Lobby. Oh, 
buy the trophy case. Trophy case, trophy case. Looking. Unless it's in the Phaser Blaster itself. Which it very well could be. Because that's like the entrance, but not in Phaser Blast. Trophy case, tro trophy case. Aha! You gotta be real close to these whenever you are going to it. Okay, how many do we have? We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We're missing six. Um. <laughs> Wait, I know where the first aid center is. We we can get that one as we go back to the end, uh, or go back to finish this up. Okay, we got the that we got that one. All right, so I think Monty Golf, Bonnie Bull, Kids Cove, Chica Bakery, and Faz Arcade. Um, I know there's something. Get in. There we go. There's something like above us. Uh, I'm a kid. Like, they don't really specify how old he is, but I think Gregory is like nine, maybe ten years old. And one of the biggest issues that I had was like, they never actually explain why Gregory is in here in the first place. Like, literally. The game starts out as like this really cool cinematic and then uh, like Freddy and everybody is performing and it's really cool, really awesome music, well, hiccup music. And then uh, Freddy like wigs out and collapses and then like it switches to Freddy in the uh, in, in his place in the Rockstar Row, and like that—that's it. You're you're Gregory. Yeah, yeah. You're. I mean, I I 100% agree. Where was the bakery? I don't remember how to get to the bakery. Ah, I'm in your foot. I just like snuck right into your foot. Is the bakery back here by dumb chance? I don't know why I can never remember where the bakery is. Oh, hello. How did I not get you? What's this? Uh, last week it was Jenkins for getting to replace the uh, urinal cakes after a single use. Uh, yesterday it was Elsa for showing up to work early. Today it's me because Lily H asked for chicken alfredo. I said we don't make that here. Her father, a guy looked like Sasquatch, by the way, demanded to speak to a manager. I get Dennis. Dennis asks me why I don't get her what she wants. I say we don't have chicken Alfredo. Denny fires me on the spot. Joke's on him, though. Turns out our new staff bots, the better employees, aren't programmed to make chicken Alfredo. So HQ fired him for firing me. Sweet revenge. Thanks, Lily. Okay. That's, uh, that's a way to do it, I guess. Anybody got smoke? There gas be leaking here. Okay, I'm back here. I don't think there's anything back here. Yeah, like I don't know. There there's a lot of holes in the entirety of like the story of this game and like who you are, why you're here, what you're doing and everything else and it's it was one of my biggest critiques up to this point because it's like i'm all for a game having some weird mumbo jumbo happening but like 
at least explain the weird mumbo jumbo every once in a while or at least by the end of the game and now granted i didn't get all of the um all of the endings yet in five nights at freddy's is like super super huge on multiple endings i don't remember a time when there wasn't multiple endings in five nights at freddy's so maybe it'll be explained but like whenever you get to 6 a.m and you have the choice to leave freddy's like you have a choice do you want to stay or leave and you're like if i leave people will keep disappearing won't they or kids will keep disappearing it's like well what the hell does that gotta do with anything like yeah probably but like also why why is that a thing that comes up at the end i'm asking why animatronics and why small children investigating disappearances of kids in a complex with animatronics that are showing signs of sentience hello i missed this i really wish those showed up on the uh, old freddy eyeballs pink slip nope Attention employees, good news. Due to the success of staff bots, we will no longer need nighttime employee coverage. We will be reducing nighttime hours effective immediately. Enjoy the additional time spent with your families. You're acting as if they didn't have rotational... Uh, did you not have enough employees to, to cover all the base? Why, Freddy, why is your face to the right? Freddy, I'm gonna need your eyeballs to be in your eyeball spot not in your ears all right i don't i don't know how to tell you this freddy but you're very unhelpful as a a light source if, if your if your cheek is the flashlight um i'm just saying jesus calm down man okay I'm pretty sure I got everything here and I'm fairly certain laundry doesn't have anything. I don't remember how to get to the flim flam and flip dick and cheeseburger sniffing bakery. Whoa. All right. We're not going to question why there wasn't anything there for a moment. Nope, not there. All right, Freddy, listen. Your cheek light is not helping, man. Is this the way out? Nope. I lost. Ah, there it is. All right. Jump in, Freddy. Freddy, is your eyeballs back on your eyes? I don't know. Probably not. I don't think the bakery was down there, but we did a, another quick run through. We found a couple messages that we missed. Let's see. There is an achievement for getting all of the messages, and I've definitely have not gotten all the messages yet there's so many and they don't show up on freddy i have ball vision okie dokie now let's try to find this stupid bakery do i hey hey guys nobody saw me i'm the best oh, i got the hiccups too you can't hear my hiccups though because i am too good and you're robots you don't actually have ears. Oh, hiccup. So, oh, I think maybe over there is where the bakery is. Had me some, uh, some Kentucky fried chicken for dinner. And I didn't even get to eat my chicken, by the way. I, my, my mom had some bad news yesterday. And then today she actually ended up having some good news, which was really nice. Um, 
And so she was like, hey, we're celebrating. I'm getting Kentucky Fried Chicken. I'm like, all right, cool. I, I was literally about to, like, make food for myself. She's like, I'm KFC. It's like, okay. Don't be long. I got stuff to do. And, uh... So, ah, it was back here. That's right. I remember now. Uh... My God, the 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 uh, the uh, where am I looking for this thing? Get back to my story in a second. I gotta figure out where the hell I'm looking. On a circular stand under the under a golden cupcake in Chica's Bakery, which can be found in the hallway behind. If I would have read the whole damn thing, I would have been able to figure out where the fuck to go. God damn it! But uh, man, the the mac and cheese is so good. From KFC, I don't know about any of you guys, but I love the mac and cheese from KFC. But uh, I didn't even get to eat my chicken. There it is. Uh, one, my my jaw is kind of sore, and it's like I didn't feel like trying to munch on the chicken, so I ate some mashed potatoes and uh, mac and cheese and a biscuit. And uh, I was I was like, I ain't got the time. I I was about to try to start turning into like at least a small piece of chicken and then it was like oh hey it's 550 uh, that's that's that hope is gone the tambourine I thought that was like a retro cd like hey this is a hint of what you should be looking for okay so we're going towards monty golf i think there was like two of them in monty golf right on the second floor of monty's golf course around hole five this is on the left side and the monty golf course sign is visible over the balcony and then another one? Yeah. No, that's Monty's golf behind Monty's. Okay, so yeah, it's just one in there then. Once again, I don't see anything that I've missed as far as collectible goes. I wonder if the retro CDs counts as collectibles Freddy I didn't move close your face or your chest what are you doing don't look at me like that I'll feed you to a crocodile well more accurately you'd probably feed me to a crocodile but I'll feed you to a crocodile Alright, let's go. Monty Golf, course one, course two. I'm telling you, I want a mini golf course like this. Like, I know there a lot of people are like, oh, mini golf, it's gone out of style. I don't give a damn. I want a Monty Golf course like this. Hey, there it is. Let's do a quick run through, make sure I didn't miss any boxes, and then we're uh, gonna GTF out of here. Got that, got that. I bet you there's a message behind here. There seems to always be messages in the back area like these. Flashlight. Oh no, you come out. You come out of that vent whenever you fight Monty. So I guess I probably would have already grabbed it. Okay, got those. Got that. I'm out the crocodilo mouth. Alright. I think it's safe to say we got everything. Let's uh let's charge up old Fred Fred boy. Ooh, maybe I should check in the side rooms here. I don't think I ever really checked in these. See if there's a message. Brr. No, no messages. Alright, let's go! All 
So we gotta keep going up. So we got the Baz Arcade and well, well, the Fazcade, I guess, and then Mazer Size and Bonnie Bull. I think I got the Bonnie Bull. I actually I'm almost 100% certain I got the Bonnie Bull because I think that's the one that started me on this path because I found it with Freddy like that because I took Freddy up to Bonnie Bull. Woo! Easy there, buddy. Bonnie Bull's up there. All right. Up she daisies. For some escalators. There they are. You know, that I should start like a GoFundMe to open up an attraction like this. <laughs> it would never get funded because the amount of freaking money that it would take would be in insane, but. Ready! There you are, buddy. All right. Mazer size. We're in the Mazer size. In the mouth of Glamrock Freddy drink dispenser at Mazer size to the left of the entrance. There she is. Um, okay, the, so we got Mazer size. How many do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. We got thirteen. We got three more that we gotta get. I know I got Bonnie Bull. I don't think I got the Kids Cove one. Actually, I'm almost a hundred percent certain I didn't get the Kids Cove one. Uh, so Kids Cove and the Foxy Plushie above the first aid station are really the only ones that I know I haven't gotten. So I must have missed the gray podium in Rockstar Row. All right. Oh, wait, no. Fazcade. I should check the Faz Arcade. Be intelligent, King. I gotta be careful. Chica likes to hang out in the Faz Arcade now. Don't. You dick. Yo! I jumped over his light. He didn't see me because I jumped over it. I'm the best. Freddy! Run through the door, Freddy. You got it. Can I break it? 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 Nope. Can't break it. Can I break it? Can I break it? Can I break it? Break it, 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 break it. Come on, 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 come on. Nope. You know, Freddy, I love how you just stand there. How did you get there? You were just... He teleported. He cheated. Yes. All right. So this one is pretty straightforward, right? This one is. <laughs> Rockstar Row, second karaoke room in the Faz Arcade. I still wish we would have been able to get Freddy dancing on the arcade floor. I'm just saying. Yeah, I did get that one. I got that. Hey, Chica. How's your face? Aha. What's up, A1 Chef? How you doing today? Two more. I still don't know. There is this box out 
this way. I don't know how to get it. Get, go, go down. Unless it's gone now and I don't remember getting it. Okay, so that must be like a completely different area that I can see. Because I did not have that one before. And now I do. But I didn't. But now I do. Where is that? Like, what is on the other side of here? That's weird. Alright. Uh, let's go. I think we got two more retro CDs to get. And I have a general idea of where I need to go for them. One I'll get on the way back because it's down towards the uh, desk and the f or the sister location area anyway. Yo, yeah. there we go. Okay, let's see. Uh, second karaoke room. I've got that one. Got the Mazer size. Cardboard cutout. Alright, I need Kids Cove. Alright, so I need to hit Kids Cove. And then I th think we're good to start heading back towards... What, what it, uh, that place over... The sister location room. Wherever it is. And then we're going to hear the rest of the... Things... I'll do it. So in my last stream, we heard the first six that I found without the help, but I'm on a bit of a time crunch today, so I couldn't do it with, or couldn't search around for hours again. I'll do it. You dick. Hi, Chica. Chica. Don't do it, Chica. Okay. That never happened. Okay. Ah, uh, let's uh go to Kiv's Cove. In a treasure chest. Try that again. In a treasure chest with golden coins in Kid's Cove. Treasure chest with golden coins. Unless I found this one, and I actually have to go to Rockstar Row for that one. But I don't think so. I don't remember getting one in here. Alright, everybody keep your eye nuggets peeled. See if we can find this treasure chest with... Goat and coins. They're, they're not very descriptive of where this is. I think it's downstairs, maybe. You know, that shocking realization has just set in that I haven't saved in quite a long time. Treasure chest. I feel like if it was in one of these areas, it would have been like, hey, it's in here. That's the theater. Am I dumb? Hello? 
Treasure chest filled with gold coins. Kids Cove. I'm in Kids Cove. Oh, is it in the? Uh, is it? The, oh God! Is, uh, do I got? Oh, is it not in this part of Kids Cove? Is it in the Kids Cove part that's like? Not Kids Cove, but it technically is. It's like where the Chica cutout was. Is that what they're talking about? No, don't know. Game, don't do me dirty like this. Unless, I mean, I explored here at first, so I'm... I'm going to go out on a limb and say it's probably not here then. Oh, that means I almost got caught by Chica for absolutely no reason other than to almost get caught by Chica. Unless, is it in here? No. Any? Is there anything in here? No. I'm missing some messages. I don't know where I'm missing some messages, but I'm missing some messages. Oh, God. I, I bet. I bet, because it didn't say in the theater, it just said in Kids Cove, and I'm willing to bet, because, like, that little fun lighthouse area where the Chica cutout is for the, for the poster, that's, like, a Kids Cove section, and that's where a lot of the pirate stuff is, and that's where a treasure chest with golden coins would be. I I bet I just left my flashlight. Well, that's a good thing. I got like all of the upgrades Freddy see you Freddy Fred bear I need your rebels Freddy Seriously? You, three steps for you. It's like six for me. Come on, man. Ha ha! -ha! Alright, I was right. I'm dumb. It's fine. I it's we're we're fine. I think we only uh, we should have fifteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, fifteen. Yes. Anybody who's listening and not watching is like, wow, King cannot count. All right, uh, let me think. Rockstar Row back this way. Nope, not that way. Because there's only one first aid station that is even remotely mentioned throughout this entire game, and that's the one where Freddy's like, <gasps> I am sensing that you're broken. I will take you to a first aid station, even though I don't know why I can sense that you are broken. You know where all the CDs are? Uh, I believe I'm on track to get my last one. I just need one more, and I, I believe I need just one more. All right, Freddy, you're too slow. I should save. Saving is a smart thing to do. All right, Freddy, I'll be back once I need you again. God, that's terrifying. Just helpy, like if you the flashlight hits him right, it's like just pure eyeballs. Freddy! It requ I know it requires Freddy. Calm down. Doodly 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 do. Going all the way down. Gregory's got the best stamina in the world. He's hyped up on sugar, and the fizzy pass probably mutated him. I am sensing that you are broken. I don't think this was the broken area. Yeah, it was. Um, okay. Ready? Oh, hey, buddy. You uh, really wanted to show up, didn't you? Good lord. All right, up here somewhere. Unless I got this one, in which case... Nope, I didn't. Yes! Last one. 
All right, let's go listen to these bad boys. All right, Freddy, you hang out there. You don't get to know what happens to Vanny because you're weird. I'll, I'll tell you. Don't worry. I'm a perfect narrator. I can explain everything that happened with Vanny and her therapist. Oh, it's such a run. Why am I vibrating? My phone has been gone, going off the hook today. None of it important. This way. Okay. That's a wall, King. You can't run through walls. You have to run around them. Just because, you know, I feel like that's going to be a good idea. There's going to be something that, like, explodes and then I'm going to die. We're, gonna, we're just going to have this save. Wait. Hey, hanging out, buddy? All right, cool. Good talk. All right. Hi, Vanessa. Would you like a candy? Butters yes. Stay. No, thank you. Those have 35 calories a piece. Hmm. Well, they taste good to me. Okay. I thought we could do something today that will help us get to know one another better. It looks like you've never taken an ink blot test, right? No? Okay. Then I'm going to show you some ink blots, like this one. And I want you to tell me the first thing it makes you think of. Here we go. What do you see here? A treehouse. Hmm, it does look sort of like a treehouse, doesn't it? Do you like treehouses? I like to sit outside and read. That's good. Now, what about this one? A beetle. Really? Looks like a face to me. That's very interesting. Okay, so, alright. Before I go further into this, alright. For those of you who don't know, I almost had a bachelor's in psychology, right? Whenever you go to give your patients a, a, a test and it's like it's subjective, like whatever they see is what they see. And so it's like up to them to decide. You're not supposed to be like, oh, yeah, yeah, that looks like a tree. How's you right? Or you dumbass. That's not a beetle. That's a face. Man, I, I tell you, this is why you messed up right here. God damn. Like, that's not how you do it. That's not how you do it. Have you thought more about what we talked about? In our last session, you told me you were sad and scared about what happened to you. I suggested <laughs> you write down exactly what made you so sad and scared. Did you do that? You know, I work with people of all ages, from little kids to the very elderly, and everyone reacts to tragedy differently. Tragedy always leads to a feeling of loss. It's a hole that feels funny, right? Yeah, so if you could process those feelings, how do you think it would affect your fantasies? Would you keep them in the way they are? I'm going to wait to dissect some of these until we get through them because they're getting like? weirder. Oh, you like those? I no. Too. They smell so sweet, don't they? Apparently, the janitor on this floor has a garden and has been putting bouquets in the offices here for years. Do you ever grow things? No? Children. Oh, I know you do. Maybe more than you should. More free time would do you good. Do you have a hobby? No? Perhaps we could find one for you. Like a sport. No? Hmm. I have a craft space in my basement. Maybe I could come up with something you could learn to do. I don't like dark basements. I'd say make yourself comfortable, but I think you already are. 
It looks like you could take a nap. That's a nice chair, isn't it? According to these message logs, you've been working pretty late over the last couple of weeks. Or not working. Are you ready to talk about who you're interacting with? From what I can see here, the interaction is getting more serious. Is it distracting you from your work? My work is important. There's a non-disclosure agreement. Good morning, Vanessa. Well, I can't blame you for looking out the window instead of listening to me. It's a gorgeous day, isn't it? I like the blue sky. Hmm, so do I. Now, let's see what we can get done on this nice sunny day. Okay, here we go. I know part of your job requires you to do online searches. But a routine audit of your search history has revealed that you're doing a little private searching on company time. Is that right? I get breaks. That's true. So, on your breaks, it looks like you were shopping for a costume. You purchased some fake fur material. What are you gonna make? What was that? Did you say the costume is a secret? Why is that? I can't talk about this. He said he would always be watching. He could be here, or there, or anywhere in between. Are you talking about your dad? Have those feelings come up again? I hate sounding like a broken record, but this is something you really need to resolve if you're ever going to be happy. I have! I compartmentalized him. He's locked away. No, that's not what I mean. You can't just ignore an issue. You have to face your memory of the experiences and process them so you can let it go. So you don't get triggered anymore. You can use a sort of self-dialogue to release these things. I don't like doing that. Hmm. Well, okay. We'll get back to that. I'd really like to know something about this costume. What's it for? Okay, I'm starting to formulate a thought in my head, but I'm gonna wait. Be transferring to a different location soon. I'll be sorry to see you go. I think we've been making progress, don't you? You can request to come back and speak with me more on your own time, though. Did you know that? Our sessions don't have to be company mandated. I have all sorts of clients, Vanessa. I don't just work with corporations. I work with individuals and small groups. I even work in schools. I'm wherever I'm needed. I'm needed somewhere else now. Thank you. Okay, so before I move on, all right, before I move on, because I kind of want to say this before it happens, I played the help wanted. I played the VR version and I remember if you got all of the cassette tapes in the VR version like the the glitched character that was behind you like was on top of you and tried to take over your body. What if now th this is this is crazy because the glitched character which i think in this universe is called glitch trap what if because the glitch character was a bunny what if the merge happened and you were playing as vanessa in help wanted and glitch trap got into you that's why she said he's always watching and he, she can't talk about this so that would make sense why it's a bunny and why she does a lot of online stuff and why nobody knows about it because the glitch trap never technically existed that's my theory. As of right now, that's my theory. When I'm getting to know a new client, I like to start by finding out directly from them what they like to do. How do you spend all the time you have? 
Nothing. Well, how do you feel about sports? You like sports? Yeah? No? Oh, I get it. You like to watch them, but not play them. You like being inside, don't you? I get that. Lots of weird stuff outdoors, isn't there? Yeah, I understand. Well, I hate to do this right off the bat, but I've been directed to ask you about this. Apparently, I'm the fourth therapist you've had. And apparently, all three of your former therapists have gone missing. Or, two of them are missing. I don't want to scare you, but I have to tell you that one of them was found dead. That doesn't seem to upset you. Well, then I guess I'll go ahead and tell you that the woman's body was pretty messed up. It looked like it was mangled by machinery. That doesn't bother you either? Hmm. It's all pretty strange, I think. I'm not clear on the circumstances. Apparently the police don't have any evidence. How does all of this make you feel? Maybe I should be watching my back. Yeah, that's funny, isn't it? Okay, shall we move on to something lighter? Okay, because see, now that's interesting because just like one or two CDs ago, she said she likes the blue sky, she likes to go outside, she likes to read outside, and now she doesn't like to go outside. She doesn't like to to like be outside and everything. And I don't know that. Uh, it's interesting. Okay. Do you know a place called Freddy Fazbear's Mega Pizzaplex? I'll take your silence as a yes. And besides, I know you know it. Because the technicians who work for Pizzaplex know you. Or rather, I guess it would be better to say that they think they do. They report that they've caught you on camera, or at least it appears to be you. Nothing to say about that? Well, the techs are convinced that you've hacked into their system many times. Although, I'll admit I don't see any proof here. Seems like they have more of a gut feeling than fact. But apparently, the hacks are causing all kinds of problems. Hmm. <laughs> you get a kick out of that? The idea of techs running around like chickens with their heads cut off? <laughs> yeah, that's a funny image, isn't it? But seriously, I have to say that I think it's weird that you'd spend so much time in such a busy, social place. You seem like more of a loner to me. Lots of time by yourself instead of with friends. Lots of time talking to yourself, right? Is it the electronics you like? I saw in your file that you have developed software programs that talk to you and repeat phrases, right? The program asks you questions and prompts you for responses. It's kind of like your own self-therapy, isn't it? Another way of talking to yourself to work things out, right? When I saw some of your recent encrypted conversation logs, that's what I thought I was looking at. It felt like I was watching someone go back and forth in their own head. But the text found something that's different than that. When I read what they found, at first, I thought I was looking at more examples of you just talking with yourself. Then I realized it was different. When I study this, it sounds like there is someone else responding to you. Who is it? Okay, so that further solidifies my point that Glitch Trap is actually inside of Vanessa. That that solidifies that a little bit more. I saw some ink blot test results in your file. I like ink blot tests. You want to do one? Yes? Okay. How about this one? What do you see? What? You want to hold it? Okay. You think it's a mask? It reminds you of a mask? Like a disguise? Yeah, I can see that. You like the idea of being disguised? Disguises let you be sort of invisible, don't they? You can get away with almost anything when you're invisible, can't you? <laughs> yeah, 
You like that idea, huh? Well, okay. Moving on. I have another report we need to talk about. Apparently, the techs were reviewing communications going in and out of this building, and they came across some interesting things. They say you were in communication with someone. Or maybe something. Pretty strange. What do you think about that? Nothing? Well, the techs say it looked to them like it was an attempt to manipulate you, or maybe to lure you somewhere. There. That's better. On this side of the desk, I can see your eyes. The thing is, when I read the communications, I get something different out of them. I don't think you're being manipulated here. I think you're the one doing the manipulating. No comment? Huh? Okay. Then how about this? I have this still shot the text pulled from the security footage that recorded you in the pizza plex. That's you, isn't it? I know this image is distorted, but I think it looks like you. And you're not alone here. You're talking to someone. Or something. It's hard to tell. What are those things? They almost look like rabbit ears. What? You find that amusing? Well, I guess it is. Okay. So, again, kind of, uh, solidifying the idea that Glitch Trap is actually inside of Vanessa. Did you I translate that, Chubbs? Also, hi, Chubbs. It's about you again. The techs have been struggling to fix some serious glitches with the robots. I'm not sure what exactly is wrong, except that it's making the robots more eerie than entertaining. You like that? Eerie instead of entertaining? Thanks, but it's really not that funny. Apparently, the glitch extended beyond the robots. It went system-wide. It began infecting all the machines, and when the techs traced the glitch back to its origin, it led them to you. I'm, I'm not going to pretend to understand everything I'm reading here, but what I get is that the system-wide glitch was like a cascade that was broadcasting a very dangerous message. While the techs were trying to reprogram the system to remove the glitch, the source of the glitch shifted. You'll have to excuse me, I'm not all that familiar with computer programming. So I might get this wrong, but what I understand is that the glitch stopped being a glitch and turned into an intentional set of subroutines that were aimed at creating the same thing the glitch created. Those subroutines seem to have come from you. Can you explain that? Listen, I'm on your side here. Our sessions are just between you and me. The text can't prove what they think, so you're not in trouble. I just thought you could tell me what you're trying to do. Maybe if we could get to the bottom of that, it could help you. What do you think? Still not talking? All right. Well, then let's do this. Why don't we talk about the research I did in your past, shall we? Some therapists think they should only focus on information they get from their clients, but some therapists, like me, think it's helpful to find out about clients from other sources. Want to guess what I found out when I looked into the tragedy of your past? All that stuff about your parents? You aren't even going to look at me? Fine. You can look at the floor all you want. But it won't change the fact that none of what you said in your file about your parents was true. The truth is, you had great parents. A great childhood. Why did you lie? Look at me. 
Tell me why you lie. You... <laughs> well, I can understand why you might feel angry about the way I just confronted you. Why don't we come back to this another day? You're shaking your head as though that's not going to happen. Okay, that's interesting. And that's all that's currently in the game. Um, and alright, Chubbs. I, I trust your judgment. You know that. I appreciate it one way or another. Um, so that's... That's really interesting. Because then there's also... This over here that I found. Which is really weird, because it's a level 12 security pass. Any other, like, really, really... You just googled it? Oh, hi, Freddy. What was it? Okay. All right. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. I gotta. I gotta. I gotta think about this here for a second because we're coming to the, like, the epic climax of everything here. So, Vanessa is Vanny. That much is obvious. I really think Vanessa is actually the one who worked in the um, Help Wanted. You were playing as Vanessa in Help Wanted. Um, or I, I would say you were playing as Vanessa in Help Wanted because in Help Wanted, Glitch Trap ends up merging with you. And everything, all of the signs are pointing to Vanessa being Vanny. And the bunny sent out a glitch Van vanny vanessa which, whatever sent out a glitch to all of the robots and all of the systems in this mega pizza plex so that they start glitching so that is why all of a sudden freddy glitched out however now this is this is the really really weird part Everyone, every animatronic here is freaking out. Can I go through here? No. And going crazy. Except for Freddy. Freddy is still being his quote unquote normal self. So. Why is Freddy immune? Gregory, you have a oh. choice to make. The door is open and it's not. you can go. Or you can continue to investigate the secrets of the pizza plex. I feel there is something else going on besides Vanny. Okay, Vanny wasn't there from before. Good to know. Thanks, Chubbs. All right. Well, we saw her hideout, right? In Phaser Blast? Maybe we could catch her there. If she thinks I escaped, maybe we can surprise her. Yes. Come. Let us end this. Door, door. Punch him, Freddy. I have a feeling that was not a good way to go about things. Can't move. Oh, am I supposed to go this way? Why are 
Whoa! Do I still have cameras? I do. Why can I not see? Why is this so dark? I mean, that's a uh, pretty impressive if that's the case. Whoa! No, no, not having fun at all, actually. I have no idea where I'm going. Negative. Hey, Monty. Hi, Monty. Yep. Okay, so we're back up here. I went up here before and I figured this out before. Alright, I can't go in there. I, for some reason, that's creepy. Is that just garbage in there? Okay, still got my sword. Nothing. Whoa! Calm down. Get out of here. Get out of here. Woo! I see you. What do you think this is? Some sort of video game where you can sneak up on me? I don't think so. Get out of here. Whoa! Ow! That hurt. Ow. Thank you. Uh, well, that doesn't look like I can open that. Door, that's a curtain. Why don't you just move the curtain? But, alright. Can't get in there. Oh. I. It's not creepy or anything. Right. Ooh, hello. Oh, how nice. Okay, where we go? I guess I'm supposed to go into here. Suck, Foxy. Get out of here. Get out of here. Go away. 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 Oh, I can't get in that way. What? That's cheating, game. You cheated. Ah, I gotta light these, I bet. That's how it always is. Bet you they're in the four corners. No? Maybe not. Oh, maybe I'm not in the corner yet. Ooh, hello. Does immediately put that... Uh, what I deleted in the band words thing, you know what I mean? Yeah, I'll, uh... I'll do that. Ooh, hey, Foxy. I'm a foxy late. Oh. I just did a big loop de loop roundabout for absolutely no freaking reason whatsoever. Foxy! Good thing I'm good at mazes. Something is not right. That is definitely Vanny. 
I picked up Vanny's head because fuck her. All right, let's GTF out of here. I guess that's that done. To be honest, I didn't even know there was a banned words thing in, on Twitch. I mean, I guess it makes sense. Whoa! Ow. I'm having my face eated. Ow. Oh, jeez. Okay, well, that hurts. Yeah, here. Ooh, 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 ooh. Uh, where do I go? How do I? How do I go? Come here. On... On YouTube? I didn't think I did. Ow. I have a feeling I did something wrong. I'm dead! I, I feel like I probably did something wrong there. Oh, do I gotta do all of it over again? Oh, God. Get out of here. Get out of here. We are perfectionists in here. We... Whoa. We get rid of all of the glitches and monsters in the games. And then we become the glitch and monster in the game ourselves. Okay, at least we kind of know what we're doing. We're going to go up and get the heart. Dude, I, I barely remember half the stuff that I've done for, like, YouTube streaming. Honestly. I really should, like, go through and... I don't know, see, I don't know if I am going to stream more on YouTube or not, like, I, I have this admiration, I guess, for the streaming side of YouTube, purely because, like, I find it to be a little bit more interactive. And uh, uh, slightly more engaging for the viewers. Like, making a video... I, I love making videos. But I also feel like streaming certain content on YouTube has, uh, has a little finesse to it that is otherwise overlooked. Okay, so that's that right there. I don't know what that does, but that is that there. All right. Aha! YouTube studio settings? Gotcha. Wait, I can't even go over here. Wait. Did I not have to die? Am I... Aha! No? Okay. Ow. You for the health. Ow, get off my face. What is this feeling? I feel it. It's deep inside me. Ow. Ow, how are you supposed to do that? Is there like a dodge? How, how are you supposed to do that? That, wait, uh, what? I, okay, I'm, I'm getting tired of doing this part. I mean, I guess it's in the old arcade style of, you know, it, you gotta do what you gotta do. And like, if you die, you start over, but like,
Okay, got that heart. Let's go get the Vanny head. And then I truly do not. Ooh, hey, Foxy being sneaky. I truly do not understand what I'm supposed to do in there. The the things are moving so fast. I can't can't move. I, I can't I can't maneuver. It pushes me right back every time. Is there like a secret that I'm missing? Is there a thing that I'm not doing? Something is not right. Yeah, you're a floating freaking head. That's what's not right. Ooh, hey, Foxy. Ooh, bad, 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 bad. Oh, get, oh, get juked. Get juked. Oh, you're so slow, Foxy. Uh, sorry. You know, you, you, you don't run fast enough for, for me. I'm too good. There's, there's gotta be like a... Ow. Okay, so I definitely need in here. Am I sp no? Cause I have to walk across. It, but how do I? I don't understand. It's like I can do this. Ow. Get hit anyway, cause I suck. Oh my god, are you serious? Wait. That doesn't... Ow. God damn it. Come here, you. Full health. Okay. So now I just gotta go... Ow, like that. Take an unnecessary hit. Ow, and I'm back up here. God damn it. How do you do that? It, it, I must be missing, like, some sort of fundamental... Ow. Mechanic. In this. I'm clicking all the buttons. This dude is still just shooting. Okay, hold on, hold on. What? What? How? I I don't want to redo all of this again. FNAF, security breach, princess quest three. Uh, how to find it? Okay, how to beat it? Okay. Uh, you find yourself in the security office, pizzeria door, several spirit bunnies in front and behind you. Uh, take the one on the right first. You'll arrive in a room filled with conveyor belts, ghosts, and ranged enemies. Make your way to the middle of the room, defeat the enemies in the section, use conveyor belts leading up to the reach the fire pit. What? Okay, so it's saying take the one on the right first. Would, does taking the one on the right make it so that the conveyors aren't moving? No, not yet. Come on. There you are. You know what this hallway kind of reminds me of? And like the cow sound. Okay. 
Arrive in a room filled with conveyor belts, ghosts, and enemies. Make your way to the middle of the room, defeat the enemies in this section, and use the conveyor belts leading up to the, reach the fire pit above you. What? There's... What? Middle of the room... What? There's... What? Ow. Ow. I'm dead again. What? Am I really dumb, or is this not making any damn sense? If anybody has some insight onto this, please let me know, because, like... I'm kind of getting tired of trying to do this part. It said take the one on the right first. There's no doors over here. Okay, hold on. Oh damn, that's uh that's kind of creepy, dude. One ahead of you, you find yourself in a seating area with doors on the left and right. Take the one on the right first. You'll arrive in a room. What? I really don't understand. I knew what you meant, Chubbs. I I really do not understand. Ow, god damn it. I truly do not understand. Ow. Like, I can't... I can't get over there. Okay, well, I got that at least. God damn it. Well, I'm gonna die again. What the fuck? This makes no sense! Alright, I'm doing freaking Foxy again because... I'll at least get the extra health. You know, I'm not even going to do Foxy. I'm just going to get the health and go. I s Ooh, hey, Foxy.
You can do that. You can do that now. Can... Ow. Nope. Can't do that. Can't, like, walk along... That part, and that pushes you so far. Well, maybe you can? Maybe? Maybe? But that's like, you have to be precise. Oh my god, are you serious? You have to be that freaking precise? Yeah, here. Okay. And I, I can't go like that. Ow, ow. Ow. What? How am I supposed to, what? And there I go again. <laughs> See, I'm I'm usually mostly fine if it's like if it's like skill related or or anything like that, but like I would hesitate to say that this is Kind of bullshit. Supposed to run to the side that I gotta go. I don't know which side I have to go. Uh, and use the conveyor belts leading up to reach the fire pit above you. Light it and then use the conveyor belts to make your way to the door top right hand corner. I didn't have an option to go on those conveyors. That's how really that's bullshit. I can't go on that conveyor. How am I supposed to get up there if I can't go on that conveyor? I tried. I got up there and it didn't let me to do anything. Oh my god, really? Again? That? Really? That's some stupid shit if I've ever seen it. Ow, really? Oh. Okay, got that now, I guess. Something is not right. Okay. Please tell me all the... Oh, thank God. Oh, all right. Well, we know how to do Foxy. What? Go. Why are you stopping? Foxy should be easy. was dumb that i i didn't like that that was really dumb go get some health i don't like i said it it'd be different it was if it was like clear but you almost had to like know that you had to quote unquote break the game just to be able to progress right there and I don't, I don't know I mean I guess you're essentially going for breaking the game in some way here no foxy fuck off 
Foxy. Foxy. Get out of here. Get out of here, Foxy. I'm too fast for you. You can't catch me. Oh, God. You can catch me if I'm dumb, but I'm not dumb, so you can't catch me. Nobody comment. Okay. I'm assuming, because the only other thing that I have now... All right, hold on. Let's get rid of that. That was... That was... Okay, so that has green around it now. A strange key. Wonder what this opens. So probably the literal only thing here. Can I go up in? Oh. Ow. Error. Okay, that's three stars. Okay, but wait. No, 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 no. No. Okay, well, we'll let it run. Okay, so, alright. I think this is going back to what we heard in the retro CDs, the therapy sessions with Vanessa. Was that Vanessa at the door to the Pizza Plex? If so, why was she there? Okay, because so, so the the thing said like the tech department found that the glitch went through the system, and that it was, it, they found that it originated from Vanessa from Vanny, and obviously the glitch is glitch trap from help wanted the the glitch bunny that merges with the person that you like you and so i mean that that that's all pretty well in doubt like i understand that i i get that but i mean okay so but i don't know there there's just so many questions that i don't quite understand Because now, like, Freddy's head, okay, so you took Freddy's head and it was in a duffel bag and you left. Freddy obviously cannot do anything as a head. And he's gonna lose power anyway, so it's gonna just deplete and diminish anyway. So it's not like it's anything important. So what, what was the importance of showing that? But also, who was at the door of the front of the pizza plex? And why were, were they? And like... There was no log, there was no record... Of... Gregory anywhere. So... It... I, I really highly doubt it's like his mom because... Like, they don't know who his mom is. Like, they never mention his mom or dad, I guess. But, like... See... But, but, okay, uh, 
Is that Vanessa? I'm fairly certain that was Vanessa, wasn't it? Okay, hold on. Hold on. Because I didn't do everything there, and then there's one. You have a choice to make. You are... That's not right. Oh no, that's not what I meant to do. It didn't let me go to Vanny. Why didn't it let me go to Vanny? Why? Why was it not Vanny? Wait, why? Why Vanny not go? Why that not? Because I want to go to Vanny. Because th there was something more. I just went for Princess Quest Three. I didn't think I was gonna get. All right, all right, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm pretty sure in the retro CDs, at some point... Okay. I need the 11. This one. 724. I guess that was the most recent save. That's fine, because that should be right, right near the exit. Anyway, and there's also other places that you can exit as well that I don't know of. Okay, yeah, we're here. All right. Gregory, you have well, Vanny. We saw her hideout, right? In Phaser Blast? Maybe we could catch her there. If she thinks I escaped, maybe we can surprise her. Yes. Come. Let us end this. I'm holding E. I'm holding E. E. I'm just going to hold it for a while. I'm just going to hold E the whole time. It's like that voice right there is very clearly glitch trap. All right, we can't actually skip this. Right, so like that's very obviously glitch trap. I'm just gonna go out on a limb and say that the purple bunny thing is glitch trap. Make that easy. Whoa! Hey, Roxy! Woo! Hold on a minute! Calm down, Roxy! Getting spicy already! Oh, chica! 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 Oh, 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 oh. oh, I took your picture just in time! Do you? Here? Here? Where? Oh. Okay, so that's the two-star ending. Okay. Can I, uh, quit? Oh, wait, there's probably something at the end of that. Oh, no. God, all right, I'll do it one more time. I'll do it one more time. There's probably a picture at the end of that. I'm very dumb. Shut up. Nobody say anything. Just shh, 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 shh.
Oh, I forgot that they do the pictures at the end. All right, uh, it was fine. We're just gonna do it again. We're uh, one more time. You know, Chica didn't know. Chica almost got us. Gotta give her another chance. See if Chica will show up again. It wasn't Chica the first time. It was it was Gator Monty Monty Gator Gator Monty. Benny, you let's go. Hideout, right? Yeah. Maybe we could catch her there. Oh, I hate when I forget about that stuff. Surprise her. Yes. Okay. Come, let us end this. So there's two other exits that I know of, right? There, and then there's one other area. There's that area in Roxy Raceway where I needed both the claws and the voice box. And then it said that you sh or it, down in the docks, you were supposed to be able to get out and something about like somewhere else that I don't remember. I'm sure it's probably in the the do 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 the doingy doingies, but I only know of the docks. Monty! I'm sorry, I don't know why that was so funny to me, just like Monty just <laughs> Okay, I can't hold e, hold e to skip this either. Alright, we're just gonna see this again. You know, I there there was something here that I didn't see, you know. Oh he 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 there's five he's in a in tears, you're crying, you're disassembling Vanny, you got very short fingernails apparently. No 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 there's like eight no's, ten no's maybe. Ah, you're watching someone get murdered. You're a murderer. Gregory, you're a murderer. Freddy, Freddy, you superstar is a murderer. Freddy, I'm a murderer. Am I still your superstar while I'm murdering? You you're a murderer too. My superstar. We're superstar murderers. All right, that's the that's that ending. All right, now we got to get through the freaking credits. I gotta not quit out and be a dumbass. Um, yeah, I don't know. I, um, Marta Zvitek, Gregory, Vanny, and Roxanne. Really? Roxanne! Don't you give me that look, Chubbs. You would have done the same thing. Christian mocap guy. Love. Nice. So the quote unquote good ending was the three star, which is we did Princess Quest 3 and released Vanessa? And so, was that Vanessa? Is Vanessa Gregory's mom? Is that why Gregory is here? She ne- like, there's been no talk about like a uh, 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 kid and any of the the files in any of the retro CDs. I don't think it's Gregory's mom, but like I don't think it's Gregory's mom, but like they get along at the end of the good ending. So who is Vanessa in the grand scheme of things to Gregory? Why? Who is Gregory? Gregory is a murderer is who he is, but why? We still have, like, the docks that we can go out. That's the only other place that I remember you could leave is the docks. So we'll go there real quick. And then if, if there's nothing there, then the only other thing that I can really...
really think of as a plausible way forward would be in Roxy Raceway. And we have roughly an hour to do it. I gotta, I gotta be done in like an hour. Yeah, credits are for napping. I wish there was like a way to speed up the credits, but you know, it is what it is, whatever. No big deal. Okay, what picture you give us this time? Uh, Fazbear Entertainment closed due to health concerns. Plans to reopen next season. No! What? No! Just leave it closed, for the love of God! Let poor Freddy sleep, man! Good lord! Alright, let's run to the docks, see if the docks give us an another ending for leaving through there. If not, then we're gonna go to Roxy Raceway. And that'll be that. Chica, was that you? Chica, are you nearby? Okay, the docks, go elevator, go downstairs, turn around, go into the food area. Cause it's the food area that I gotta go. Boo doo, boo doo, boo doo, boo doo. Do do boo do boo do do go. Do do boo do do boo do boo do. Boo do boo do boo do boo do do boo do boo boo do. Boo do boo do boo do boo do. Boo do boo do boo boo do boo boo. Boo do boo 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 boo. I gotta say though, like. Whoever made the music for, I, I say whoever, but it's literally played in front of me like four times today already. The the music design in this is just uh, phenomenal. By the way, what emote is that? Oh, it's a better TTV global emote. That's weird. I love the, the, the music is amazing. I think they did a fantastic job. Like sound design wise, I think they did a phenomenal job with the sound design. I really, really do. The game sounds amazing. There's some audio glitches and some things that could use a little updating as far as like audio th goes, but like the the all in all like overview of like audio, I think is a really, really well done aspect. Yeah, so right here, right? Gregory, you have a choice to make. Oh, okay. All right, let's leave. Wait, wait. Freddy's dialogue is still just there. map box please take this map please take this map map Gregory, my battery. Freddy! Gregory!
That's another two-star ending. Okay. So that's what? We got four endings. We got the leave. We got the leave out the front door. Leave out the docks. We got the princess quest. And we got the kill Vanny ending. Oh, this is lovely sounding. Okay. So that one, that's more what I was expecting at, well, not necessarily Gregory driving, but like them just getting out and being done with it. Like that's kind of what I was expecting. The leave out the front door, put Gregory in a box and he fell asleep and it said more kids gone missing. And Vanessa went and just picked them up and then like made them go. Why are kids going missing in the first place? Sir, circling back around to the original thing that I was asking, why are kids going missing in the first place? Why is Gregory here? Uh, gee, you got my attention. I I'm a lover of saxophone. I love the sound of a saxophone. Oh yeah. Some lo-fi jazz. Oh, a nice two-star ending. Ooh. Do so you remember the other way that we could escape? There was like three ways out. There was the uh, the docks, the front door, or the like. Whenever you got to the front door, the front door closed, and like he was like, "Okay, well, you can either get out through the docks or through." Was it the security office upstairs? No. Yet yeah, no. Yes no. Yet yeah, no. Yes no. I was like, hmm, do I tell him? I don't really think I want to sit here through more credits. I love the addition of the flute there. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Oh, yeah. That's a that's a that's a sexy sound right there. I love I love saxophones. New face of Freddy Frazbear Entertainment. Okay, so there's the hippo and Monty took over. Okay, so that's Monty's ending, I guess. We'll call that Monty's ending. Okay, we're gonna have a quick look in our watch, real quick. See if I can find where you, the third escape route was. And if I don't have it, then I think that'll... Alright, get out. Main entrance, no re-entry. Uh, slide into fun. Free Freddy. Main lobby, find the lobby, connect to the security system. Let there be light. Escape to daycare. Prize counter. Five until loading dock. Okay, so I don't think... Okay. I don't know. I don't know what the other way would be to leave. So we're just going to go to Roxy Raceway. I am running out of time for today anyway. So Roxy Raceway it is. We got 45 minutes. I imagine all of them are the same. Like, if I would go back to the Chica exit, or what, what I'm calling the Monty ending, I imagine if I would do the Vanny, the Vanny thing would be the same exact thing again anyway. 
Unless it's something to do with the prize counter. God, I wish it saved like transcripts of what Freddy said at, and you could like go back through and read them at the beginning. Escape the pizza plex. Yeah, it. I don't know. It, it, it is what it is. We're just gonna. We're just gonna go to Roxy Raceway. Let's see what's over here. And then, I don't know, maybe. I, I'm sure I've missed something. I'm sure there's. Like, I know I didn't get all the messages. I know I didn't get all of the uh, collectibles. Somehow, I haven't gotten all the collectibles. Even though I've, like, gone through everything with the fine tooth comb. Like,. I'm still missing something somewhere. Or some things, I should say, somewhere. Yeah, I think it was down this way. Yeah! Nope, didn't make it. I don't know if you can actually jump down that. I doubt it. Ready! There we go. Good job, Freddy. Way to slash open an already open gate. Thank you, Freddy. I uh, appreciate your help. All right, let's see. Gregory, oh. be careful. This elevator does not appear to follow any safety protocols. I do not think it can survive more than one trip. Okay, is that indic- Yes? Question mark? Is that indicative of a bad time? I prepared to test off with- Freddy, what are you doing? Freddy, stop it. Stop it. The music- Well, oh, Freddy! 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 Oh, uh, mm. Why are you there? Are you gonna kill me? Are you gonna kill me, aren't you? Are there any collectibles down here, Freddy? I feel like uh, collectibles are important. Right, there's generators. Uh, I hate that. I hate it. I, I'm gonna say it. I'm I I hate that. Whoa! Hey, calm down there, endoskeletons. Oh wait, Freddy Fazbear's Pizza Place. Why are you here? Oh, you. Freddy! I could have just came from where you were before, if I'm being honest. Any, any collectibles, Freddy? Oop. Any, any collectibles, Freddy? Freddy, this is okay. Hmm, right. Nope, Freddy, I didn't mean to call you. Just stay there. What are these generators and why? Why is there a recharging station right there? Okay, that's an old door that doesn't open. Um...
think I've turned on all the generators. Okay, this might sound crazy. But I think we're in Pizzeria Simulator place. I, I don't know what this is. I have been here before. She brought me here. I found myself for the first time when I cleared the path. I did not want to, but I had no choice. Now I have a choice. I have changed. My friends are here. They are so angry, confused. But I can protect you. I am not me. Uh, okay, Freddy, you saying you're not you when I'm inside of you? Does not bode well for me or bring me any kind of comfort. If I'm being honest. Where, where am I? Where am I supposed to go? Where? What? Freddy, you need a recharge? Bonnie! Bonnie, is that you? better days is that Bonnie I don't know is is uh, are you Bonnie okay can't get in there it's Roxy what do I do oh you've got to be kidding me what do you mean hide hide where okay this dude moved he's in there now Okay, Freddy. Freddy, 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 Freddy. Freddy, 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 where? The, here? No. Here? No. Here? Yes. Can you get me over here? Please tell me you can't get me over here. Ooh! Are you a sad foxy? Are you are you a sad? Are you sad? Big sad? Freddy, Freddy, come here. Ah, oh, nuts. 
Where? Where? Is it this one? No. Is it this one? Yep, that was that one. Go on, go on, go on, go on. Please, please, please don't spit me out. Please don't spit me out. Please don't spit me out. Nope. Foxy, Foxy. Wait, that's Vanny. Wait a minute. I keep calling you Foxy, Roxy. We can talk about this, please. Roxy, Roxy, we can talk about this. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 58, 63, 67? Where? Which one? I don't know. I just got to run for it. I think that was it. I think that was it. I think that was it. No, no. Oh, oh, oh. You suck. All right, well, we're just gonna do this tango for a little bit, huh? Ain't that something? You were... Horrifying. I'm back over here. Nuts. Ooh, I don't know which one. That one. All right, got up. Good, get in. You uh. almost left. Is, is this broken? Is the game broken? Did I break the game? Is Am I not doing anything? Am I progressing? I don't know if I'm progressing. Roxy, are you supposed to be able to be gone by now? Is it 6 a.m. yet? I feel like there's a lot of questions that I gotta ask. Is it, I feel like this is a little obnoxious at this point, don't you think? Roxy, I feel like you should go back. Okay. It didn't you? All right, we're in the wall now. That's normal. You're low power. Why are you all of a sudden at low power? You were full like five seconds ago. What did you do this time, Freddy? We're just going to keep doing this. Maybe it'll eventually work. It almost looks like she's dancing, doesn't it? Do uh, oh, do little dance, oh uh, yeah. 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 I'm sorry. What? stars okay I did it I feel like I broke the end there but I did it okay so 
that one I got nothing on. Well, well, think back to Pizzeria Simulator, which I did play through the entire thing. I think that's actually on the channel. I don't know if I played through and did all the endings on it, but I did play through it all. Um, so thinking back to it, in Pizzeria Simulator, the, the whole idea was to literally salvage all of the animatronics and put them into this infinite loop and it turns out that there was no way out and you were literally there to sacrifice yourself so that you could burn down the entirety of the pizza plex the pizzeria and kill all of the animatronics That is what I'm picking up from that. I'm picking up that in there, that was the pizzeria that we were, like, you were not supposed to be able to escape in Pizzeria Simulator. And that's why all of the animatronics were in one place and all of them were very angry. He went back there, like, Vanny forced him to go back there, I guess, and see himself. And he saw that he wasn't Freddy or something. I don't know, but he is not him maybe meaning he is not like the the killer freddy he's the good freddy which is interesting but i i don't I don't quite see how that is relevant. I mean, maybe it's just tying in some of the games that he made on the side that were like not really canon to the main things. And so that was like the tie-in. So that, that must have been the facility that was drawing a huge amount of power and everything. But like... Was that Bonnie? That couldn't have been Bonnie. That was that Bonnie? Oh, it's Freddy and Gregory. But uh Freddy, how are you uh I mean I guess same way as the uh, Monty ending. Okay. Alright. That's gonna do it for me for right now. I truly do not know of any other endings i could potentially even go for uh i did get three new achievements uh let's see i'm at 23 out of 20 29 i'm missing six uh it's from until 6 a.m find a party pass dodge and weave up up and away no room for desserts uh double-edged sword say cheese sugar high heckler uh are you having fun yet get the good ending so we got the quote-unquote good ending uh hazard pay find the source of rossi rakes roxy raceways problems okay so i got that shatter chica shatter roxy shatter monty F i am not me freddy is shattered is that the uh is that is that the um the vanny ending I'm thinking maybe that's the Vanny ending. Okay, so I know two of the last achievements. I want to see this here real quick. Uh, FNAF, Security, Breach, Achievements. I know I know two of them. And yeah, I saw the server was up. Um, surprise, I, I got Dodge and Weave, Sleepover, I got Pizza Party, False Alarm. Do what? Oh, interesting. Interesting. Okay, so there's a there's an achievement here. Hold on, do I have false alarm? Because I don't know if I have false alarm. Da, ba, da. 
Hazard pay. Okay, I do have false alarm. Okay. Yeah, I did see they're making Tom. Uh, uh, Tom Holland is um, the main character. Uh, Tom Holland has been doing a freaking phenomenal job, by the way. I, I, Tom Holland, I believe, is going to be one of the next big A-listers we're going to see in all the movies. He's an amazing actor. Party time, laser race, no room for dessert, say cheese, speak claw and see no evil, wub wub wub, superstar, I am not me. All right, so the disassembled ending. Uh, you need to complete Phaser Blast minigame. Once Phaser Blast head into the vent, hold up. Okay, after this point, simply reach towards 6 a.m., Choose the new option and play until you get the credits and you will earn this achievement. Okay. Uh, security breached. Get the highest security access possible. Do I have that? I don't think so. Over. No, I don't. Get security level 8 and you will earn this achievement. I think I only ever got 6, so I missed 2 security badges somewhere. Double-edged sword I got. Up up and away I got. Sugar high I got. Under par I got. Hazard pay I just got. Are you having fun yet? Get the good ending. Uh, Yeah. Heckler I got. Opa. Break 10 plates. Again, didn't know that was a thing. Hide and seek master. Never use a hiding spot. Okay. Find all collectible messages. Yeah, that's one that I know I don't have. And then find all prizes is another one that I don't have. So trophy time, all the uh, all the prizes, all the collectibles, hide and seek, break 10 plates. Wait, what? Prizes, messages, hide and seek, 10 plates. What's the... Because then there's one for getting all of them. Oh, and security breached. Okay. So I feel like I, I got all of the endings then. I feel like I did at least get all of the endings, which is one of the big things that I wanted to make sure that I did. So that is going to do it for security breach i think that that's gonna do it i think that's gonna be the end of five nights of freddy's security breach at least for me we didn't do like everything but we got pretty much everything that we possibly could have i might play through the game again in my spare time just to get the uh hide and seek master where you never use a hiding spot because like i kind of know the game now i can kind of probably plow through it in about an hour hour and a half whatever so i don't know maybe and i might get all the collectibles i don't know it'll depend on how i feel i might not even do the hide and seek master but i liked it uh it definitely needed some tweaking i definitely 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 believe that there were things that the development team wanted to do originally with the game that it didn't actually end up being and so they had to completely change it for the full release which i'm not a big fan of admittedly i'm not a big fan of it, it feels like they rushed a lot of it so i would have liked to see them delay it a little bit and kind of make it a little bit more cohesive in the long run but still not bad i would i would give it a i would give it a six maybe a seven out of ten for a game uh, just overall in my like 12 to 15 hours of gameplay that i've done on it now i'd give it a i'd give it a, a, a six maybe seven so thank you guys so much for watching thank you guys for everything as always uh check out the patreon if you want to help support me and all of the work that i do link in the description below uh i will be having the script for the video that i want to make uh in I brought out to the patrons here probably next Friday and then uh, to the public probably on March 1st. So definitely worth uh, keeping up to date with that. And uh, yeah, thank you guys so much. Uh, go out, do something nice for somebody today. And I will see all of you guys next time. Bye, guys. Bye. I know it takes forever to say goodbye. So bye. Bye, guys.